banknotes that you never knew were rare. You want to be looking through your paper money when you're going through them because the bills in this video sold for so much money, you would not want to miss any of them whatsoever. Let's take this $10 bill, for example, that sold for $17,037.50. This is a 1928 $10 bill. It's good to know that 1928 was actually the first year they started producing small size paper money. Before that, all bills were actually large size bills, which are much larger than we're used to seeing today. What you need to know on this specific bill is the fact that it was graded by PMG at a 50 net. So the corner has been repaired and the bill has actually been trimmed with some scissors. So don't do that because it will decrease the value and there are multiple folds on this bill. Now what makes this bill so rare and unique is the fact that when you flip it over, you see the back is actually a five. Some collectors will call this a $15 bill or a dual denomination error bill. One of my favorite types of notes right here very jealous of whoever has this such a cool note if you come across a rare 15 or 10 five dollar bill like this you're in for a real treat because seventeen thousand thirty seven dollars and fifty cents for that one eighteen thousand dollars for this twenty dollar bill from 1928 now this is considered to be a light green seal light green seal notes are more rare than normally issued green seal notes there is a little bit of value there but the main reason is the fact that this is a star note from 1928 so star notes happen when a sheet of bills will have an air on it and what the quality control manager will do at the time is they'll get that sheet of bills destroy it and produce a new sheet of bills with a replacement sheet and a star at the end of every serial number that's what this person did when they found it they got it graded by pmg they got the 65 grade and they sold it for eighteen thousand dollars all right so if you're looking at the back of this bill it's important to know that the back of the bill during the production process of paper money the back is the first print the front is the second print and in between the second and third print here the third print being the overprint someone put a Del Monte banana sticker in between. What a little hooligan there. But in 2006, this bill sold for $25,300. And this is the same note that sold in 2021 for $396,000. It is the same exact note, but graded by PMG. This is a very important factor to know that market conditions are so important because the same note sold for a much different amount of money in 2006 versus 2021. And a very important thing to know here as well is that if you have a a rare obstruction error like this, never ever remove the obstruction because it will decrease the value. For example, if this bill did not have that Del Monte sticker there, but instead there was a white patch, it would look a lot less appealing and people would not want to pay that much money. So if you have an obstruction error, keep it as it is, get it certified by a company like PMG because this one sold for $396,000. If you enjoyed this paper money video, smash that subscribe button and we will see you in the next one.